Alright, alright, welcome to this. Uh, this is the last tree. Uh, I just installed it off Epic, have no idea what it is. Um, I'm hoping it's going to be like an Abzu type of game, remember that one? Yeah, that, that one's an old one. So we're just gonna get straight into it. Ooh. Uh, okay, so, yep, 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 we're good. Okay. We good. Ooh. Oh, that's nice. So by the looks of it, it looks like it's uh, about a fox. Ooh, pretty. Oh, Jesus, it's loud. Oh my god, is that loud. Okay, I've turned it down now, so it should be... Are you awake? I thought I heard you get up. <coughs> yeah, I'm awake. Sorry, I just can't sleep. Are you thinking about about him? Yeah, a bit. You should get back to sleep, my love. I'm fine. No, no, it's okay. What else is on your mind? Ooh. I don't know. It seems weird, but I had one of the most vivid dreams of my life. I saw a fox on a snowy mountain, just looking confused and worried. Those eyes. I can't get those eyes out of my head. <laughs> you mean these eyes? <laughs> looking for something. Do you think it has to do with, with you and what's been going on? I don't know. It was just a dream, Rachel. They're not meant to make sense. Dumb, Lots happened in the past dumb, couple days. <gasps> well, if you're not going to sleep anyway, you should tell me. I want to hear. All right. Uh, I'm just gonna. I'm pretty sure. Hold on. Gotta do some audio things here, cause. Wow, is that loud? Wow, that is this is some loud game. I have my desktop audio on eight percent. That's how loud this thing is. My God. Okay. <laughs> Not the first time I've done that either. Abs, you did that. But this fox can double jump. I'm sorry. All right, let's go. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go forward. Oh, this game looks pretty. So pretty. Looks like an absolute style game. I wonder if it's by the same people. There isn't much. Oh no. She couldn't stay though. She had to find her other two children. So she took that path. She followed it towards something ancient. Something with answers. Ah, so that was one of our kids. No. Ah, so that tree right off in the background, if you can see it, I'm assuming that's what we have to get to. I don't know how long this game will be. Fox looked high and low, searching for any sign of her cubs. Points of light showed the way to this ancient tree. It was as if each one had a story to tell all their own. The land was trying to tell my story, too. I 
felt like I was right behind her the whole time. It's epic, not steam. I forgot. I got an achievement. Nice. Plop. Guess we get these points of light then. God, look at this place. It, this game's great. Look at it. Look how nice it looks. Still so loud. Okay, hopefully that should be fine now. Okay, I was checking OBS because I don't know if I actually started recording. <laughs> Encoding overloaded. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I keep trying to hold shift. It doesn't work like that though. It's not a first person shooter. Oh Jesus. It is very loud in my ears. So. Got that again? <laughs> Ooh. Water. Oh. Wasn't he like a lumberjack? <laughs> That's one way of putting it. If wood was a canvas, and a carving knife was his paintbrush. Even after working 50 hours a week, even after his hands were more splinters than skin, he would bring home the nicest piece of Alaskan woodland cedar and make me toys. That wooden train was the first toy I could remember. I just knew from a young age I was going to be a lumberjack, like my father. Oh, that's nice. So this game has uh, quite a vivid story then. Or, oh, not vivid really, more in-depth I suppose. I thought that tree was like a great elk or something, thought I was going to get curb stomped. <laughs> more light. Ooh. Loading screen. First of the game. Oh, look at this! Oh my god! Look at the environment. So nice. My teenage years were full of sketching, angst, and trouble. I wasn't mm. popular or unpopular. Maybe just forgettable. I guess that gave me a sense of freedom. So I hung out with crazy kids, doing crazy things, even though I mostly just watched the chaos ensue. <laughs> we did it all. Put fireworks in mailboxes, hide roadkill in people's garages break windows of the barber shop in Anchorage. My dad was furious, but he was so busy working he couldn't do much to stop me from going out. I think being an adult means there's no one to stop you making hard decisions. He had to make a living, and he couldn't be in two places at once. Yeah, I realize that now. But at the time, I was sure he was more interested in growing his business than what was going on with me. 
Hmm. A new chief? So that means new police chief. I think... Hmm. Is this game gonna be like, this guy has gone missing... Like, we're gonna find him, like, dead, probably. <laughs> I mean... It indicates that there was a police search. The narrator is maybe missing, or the chief. I mean, there's a police car here. It, it, it would make, I guess, a little bit of sense. Or he's dead and he's now a fox or something, I don't know. <laughs> Does it look like I know? <laughs> he was working another late night, and my friends were over, saying how bored they were, and how they'd Cockies. come all the way out to my house for nothing. One of them mentioned how that old, ugly, beyond belief truck still in the garage, and now we should take it for a spin. <laughs> I was only 15, so I kind of fought it for a while. The next thing I knew, we were craning around the mountain path, rocks spitting onto the sides of the cliff, while my dad's cringeworthy bluegrass blared out the speakers. <laughs> I drove while my friends were in the back of that yellow and purple truck, throwing beer bottles and trash at anything remotely interesting. It felt like I was soaring. Oh, well, I've hit the world wings. But all good things have endings. A cop outside of Eagle River pulled us over after he saw some bottle rocket into someone's yard. Uh, what followed was a long night of talking uh, up to there. disappointed adults and feeling smaller than ever. Yeah, that that's bound to happen if you do something dumb like that. I mean, what do you think was gonna happen, Chief? <laughs> Ooh, purple one. Yeah, we're going to get that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> ah, up here. Okay. Hello. <gasps> we got butterflies. Oh my god. Okay, well, I ain't gonna try that because I'm bad at this game, apparently. It's nice that you got a choice of whether you wanna. Uh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> Butterflies collected. Because apparently these make us fly higher, uh, jump higher, sorry, I don't know. Whee! Nice. Woohoo! Uh, <laughs> it's a very simplistic game, but uh, that waterfall is interesting over there. Oh. Maybe I shouldn't critique games <laughs> that I can't even play. You know? <laughs> but no, the rest of this game looks bloody amazing. I mean, that does as well. It's still very nice. It doesn't make a lot of sense. We. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, there's that, there's that truck. Maybe it's just someone's dreamscape, you know? Looks like we have to go that way. If there's nothing behind this waterfall, I will be very disappointed. Oh my god, does the water have reflections? Damn! Anything behind it? Nah, oh. Worth a shot. This area is really pretty. I mean, the rest of this game is very simple, but very, very pretty. Very pretty. Guess we just gotta move along. That is a screenshot and a half. Just this entire area is, I guess. You know? 
Yes, I did just control print screen that. I think I'll use that as like the thumbnail or something like that. Oh. Okay, I will guess I guess I will go get the others. Do you have to use free? Hmm. Gonna try it anyway. I think you can get woo too. Guess we'll find out in a second. This fox can jump surprisingly high, and I know that foxes jump high anyway. Oh, we were supposed to hit that thing over there. <laughs> Whoops. We'll just go get that. <laughs> that is really nice. This game is pleasant. It's so... Just, it's so different to all the games i played recently. So used to the chaos of like Team Fortress 2 or something, you know? After he drove me home from the police station, I blew up at him, saying how I never wanted to be like him, how I was gonna be someone, leave that hick icebox for good. He just looked forward at the road with tired eyes. I took out that bluegrass tape from the cassette deck and chucked it out the window. In my sage teenage wisdom, I thought I'd prove the ultimate point. <laughs> but my dad had a different idea. He slammed the brakes, slowly bowed his head while gripping the steering wheel, and finally looked at me. All he said, like it was a polite request, was, make this right. I sat there in silence, fuming, but I eventually got out and combed every square inch of the woods, muttering profanity after profanity. I found it thirty minutes later, near a small waterfall off the road. I went back to the truck, put the wet tape back in, and sure enough it worked. We oh. didn't speak another word to each other the rest of the night. Wow, I knew you were a crazy teenager, but... It's hard to believe, isn't it? It surprises me, too. It's like yes. I didn't really know who that Got kid it. was back then. I bet my dad thought the same thing over and over. <laughs> it's almost like he was saying, make this right to himself, more than to me. Well, sometimes people have points to prove that they shouldn't prove, you know? Or well, they think they've got points to prove and then just make a mountain out of a molehill, you know, screw screw everything up for everyone. That's uh, never great. I don't know if I'll be able to get all three. There is no way to climb onto this rock unless we can get... Oh, never mind. Yeah, we can. Um, You know, this is a... Something that a lot of people can probably relate to, given that they've everyone's had a fight with their parents at least once. And I mean, I know I have. My yeah, yeah. friends would laugh about that night and talk about how crazy it was. And I laughed along, pretending it didn't bother me. <laughs> but it did. I imagined my friends growing old in the bush, unable to find that thrill in those godforsaken ice fields. It's like those mountains were a literal wall, keeping me from leaving. Where all I would have to look forward to are lumber yards and evening beers. I had to climb over. That was my only goal for a long time. Whoa! Look at that! Oops! Whoa! That's not the right one. There we go. Now oh, that's beautiful. Alright, come on. If there was some way I could take my love of drawing and turn it into a way of escape. Oh, a wolf. Make me happy. I wanted to create instead of tearing trees down. Wolf and a fox. I moved to the lower 48, not because I hated it there in Alaska. I hated the idea of it. It's like all 
of that spite inside me had created this monster which followed me around my whole teenage years. I put so much energy into doing what others didn't expect of me. Why did I do that? There's one fact you're forgetting, though. If you didn't have that fire in you, we probably would have never met. You're absolutely right. Maybe the destination is all that matters in the end. Then why am I awake? Why am I seeing this fox go on her journey? And why can't I stop thinking about my dad? <laughs> weirdest dreams can bring out the weirdest memories. You never know. Oh, seems like we're changing area again. Oh, it's 20 minutes already? Wow. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Is that it? How long is this game? <laughs> okay, we Ooh. Secrets. Secrets first. Story later. <laughs> Might be able to do this game all in one day, and that's pretty cool. There's a thing over here. Looks like the tree. That's the end already. Oh, there's a mattress. Did he get, like, was he sofa surfing for ages or something? Ah, it's up there. I see you. A bit of parkour we gotta do, I guess? Uh, okay, I think we'll do this bit, and then we'll do, and then we'll end it. Because if I know games like this, it usually isn't the end once you get to the de facto uh, destination. It's usually something after. So I'm praying that I'm right. Ah, oh, the music too. The music's very good. Again, reminds me of Absu. So, so good. What is this? How are you supposed to do this then? <laughs> Ah, okay. This is a nice area to, to sit. There's one over there. I'm assuming there's going to be one more later down the line near the tree. Okay, well this is where I'm ending it. This is a very nice area to end it in. Sorry it was so loud at the start to anyone listening with headphones. I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, the audio should be fine next time though. Uh, so yeah. See ya, I guess. Till the next one.